welcome you to the seventh Sunday of Easter. But today we are celebrating Ascension, an extraordinary gift of God who encourages us to go out and make disciples of all nations. We remain unable to join together physically, but we are together as one body in Christ. And so I remind you, my sisters and brothers, we are the body of Christ. Spirit is with us. The peace of the Lord be always with you. And also with you. Go and make disciples of all nations, Jesus commands. I am with you always to the close of the age. Let us pray. Almighty God, to whom all hearts are open, all desires known, and from whom no secrets are hidden, cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of your Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love you and worthily magnify your holy name through Christ our Lord. Amen. Hear, O Israel, the Lord our God, the Lord is one. You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart and with all your soul and with all your mind and with all your strength. Jesus said, this is the great and first commandment and a second is like it you shall love your neighbor as yourself christ has entered heaven itself there to appear before god on our behalf let us therefore draw near in full assurance of faith and confess our sins to the God of grace. Merciful God, our Maker and our Judge, we have sinned against you in thought, word and deed and in what we have failed to do. We have not loved you with our whole heart. We have not loved our neighbours as ourselves. We repent and are sorry for all our sins. Father, forgive us. Strengthen us to love and obey you in newness of life. Through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And now the absolution. Almighty God, who has promised forgiveness to all who turn to him in faith, pardon you and set you free from all your sins, strengthen you in all goodness and keep you in eternal life through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. And now let us pray for all those across the world who are struggling in this broken world. Lord, have mercy. Christ have mercy. Lord have mercy. Lord have mercy. The Collect for Ascension Day. Grant, we pray, Almighty God, that as we have believed your only Son, our Lord Jesus Christ, to have ascended into the heavens, so we may also in heart and mind hither ascend and with him continually dwell, who lives and reigns with you and the Holy Spirit, one God, in glory everlasting. Amen. Amen. Our psalm today is Psalm 47. O clap your hands, all you people, 
and cry aloud to God with shouts of joy. For the Lord Most High is to be feared. He is a great king over all the earth. He has cast down his peoples under us and the nations beneath our feet. He chose us a land for our possession that was the pride of Jacob, whom he loved. God has gone up with the sound of rejoicing and the Lord to the blast of the horn. O oh, sing praises, sing praises to God. O oh, sing praises, sing praises to our King. For God is the King of all the earth. Oh, praise him in a well-wrought psalm. God has become the king of the nations. He has taken his seat upon his holy throne. The princes of the peoples are gathered together with the people of the God of Abraham. For the mighty ones of the earth are become servants of God, and he is greatly exalted. Glory to God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit, as in the beginning, so now, and forever. Amen. Our Gospel today is according to Matthew, verses 20, uh, chapter 28, verses 16 to 20. Glory to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Now the eleven disciples went to Galilee, to the mountain which Jesus had directed them. When they saw him, they worshipped him, but some doubted. And Jesus came and said to them, All authority in heaven and on earth has been given to me. Go therefore and make disciples of all nations baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit and teaching them to obey everything that I have commanded you. And remember, I am with you always to the end of the age. For the gospel of the Lord, praise to you, Lord Jesus Christ. Go into the world in peace and love and serve the Lord. In the name of Christ. Amen.